in new at 10. A disturbing mystery unfolding in the Fountain Valley. A number of kittens and cats going missing or turning up dead all in the same neighborhood. Neighbors fear somebody may be poisoning them. He's by Zach Thaxton looking into it. He's live in studio with more details. Zach. Rob, this all began about a month ago in the Sunrise Ridge neighborhood near Fontaine and Powers. Neighbors say it can't be coincidence that so many animals are affected in such a brief period of time, and now they're afraid for all pets in the neighborhood. There's definitely something going on in this neighborhood. Early June in the Sunrise Ridge neighborhood in the shadow of the Widefield Water Tower. It begins with a single feral kitten found dead with blood coming from its nose. And then the rest of the litter, which is four kittens, vanished. Nowhere to be found. Shortly after, a grisly discovery. Two neighborhood house cats found dead on a busy sidewalk. The cats were found lined up on the sidewalk with uh, blood coming out of their noses, almost as if it was just presented that way. Freddie and Scout, unrelated house cats from homes two blocks apart, dead side by side blood coming from their noses. It didn't just happen. Cats don't just lie down next to each other and die. In another instance, two more feral kittens found dead side by side. The circumstances all so bizarre and similar, fearful neighbors suspect foul play, perhaps poisoning. On the next door app, reports of squirrels found dead the same way. We as a community are outraged because these are people's pets. These are wildlife. These are feral cats and someone needs to stand up for them. Scouts owner afraid to appear on camera. Freddie's owner afraid to talk at all, both fearing retaliation for going public if someone is killing neighborhood animals. The Pikes Peak Humane Society tells News 5 exams of the dead kittens found evidence of malnourishment, but no sign of poison. The side-by-side -side house cats too decomposed by the time of exam to reveal definitive results. The fact that they were lined up the way they were on the sidewalk when they were found is just too much of a very weird situation. Maybe someone knows something, has seen something weird and just hasn't spoken up, but um, it's getting out of hand. As there is no definitive evidence yet of any poisoning of the cats, there's no criminal investigation being conducted by the El Paso County Sheriff's Office. The animal control officer investigating the deaths was off shift this evening, but is due back in the morning. We intend to follow up. Meanwhile, Sunrise Ridge neighbors are asking everyone in the area to keep an eye out for anything suspicious. Always watching out for you, Fountain Valley. Zach Thaxton, News 5.